Federal trial of former Chicago Alderman Ed Burke resumed today with testimony from a former employee of the Field Museum. And WJN Shannon Halligan is here to connect the dots in the prosecution's case. Shannon. Yeah, federal prosecutors laid out their case that the former alderman used his position of power and threatened to block a source of funding for the Field Museum. The jury along with, uh, followed along with transcripts of the recordings, which we're hearing for the first time. Members of the jury heard phone recordings in the trial of former alderman Ed Burke. Federal prosecutors outlined how they say Burke abused his public office for private gain. The recordings came from Burke's phone, which had been secretly wiretapped by the FBI. On Monday, the testimony centered on the Field Museum. Prosecutors played a call between Burke and the former president and CEO of the museum after Burke's goddaughter, Molly Gabinski, applied for an internship there. The application slipped through the cracks and Gabinski didn't get the position. I said, uh, of course, Richard's a very good friend of mine and if the Field Museum is asking for uh, applications to fill these interns, I'm, I'm certain that uh, um, if I call him, he'll uh, give her every uh, consideration. The museum's governmental affairs director, Deborah Beckin, had called Burke earlier to discuss a proposal to raise fees at the museum. I was quite um, disappointed and, um, and surprised that I never heard another word after my initial uh, request. Okay. So now that you're going to make a request of me. From the witness stand, Beckin said, I perceived it as a threat. I perceived him to be very upset because of an internship application that we had not acted on. Burke's defense attorneys argued that Burke's only interest in the admissions fees was to protect Chicago families from high fees and had previously said that the angry phone call, while harsh, wasn't criminal. The Park District ultimately approved the admission price increase at the Field Museum, and Burke's goddaughter never worked there. The trial is expected to resume tomorrow. Burke has pleaded not guilty to the charges. All right, Shannon, thanks.